The process of saving for retirement is commonly understood, save a certain amount each year, invest it, and give your nest egg time to grow. But once you're ready to retire and start living on that income, things can quickly become more confusing. If you spend any time on the internet, you will quickly discover that there are many approaches to generating retirement income. To help you evaluate those approaches, a concept called equivalent portfolio value or EPV can be helpful. Simply put EPV, evaluates how much income one approach can generate versus another. And what it will take for two different approaches to generate the same level of income. To help see this consider siblings Bill and Jill, both spent their working years saving for retirement. They are planning to retire in five years. And each of them have identified a portion of their savings, $550,000, from which to generate retirement income. After doing some math, both Bill and Jill determined that they would need $40,000 a year from this portion of their savings to meet their retirement income needs. Bill decides to use a drawdown approach while maintaining an asset allocation strategy with drawing 4% annually based on his $550,000. Today 4% would only generate $22,000, just over half of what he needs. In order to generate the $40,000 from his investment plan, his $550,000 will need to grow to $1 million in five years. Alternatively, Jill decides to utilize a fixed index annuity to generate the $40,000. The fixed indexed annuity guarantees that if Jill places $550,000 in it today, in five years, the insurance company would begin paying her the $40,000 she needs each year for as long as she lives. To put it another way Jill's $550,000 fixed indexed annuity has an EPV of $1 million. By using a fixed indexed annuity, Jill has peace of mind that she will receive the income she needs in retirement. On the other hand, in order for Bill to generate the level of income he needs, in the 4% drawdown approach, it would require his portfolio to earn an annual rate of return of over 12% before fees and taxes each and every year, for the next five years. Only then will Bill have the $1 million he needs for retirement. Using EPV can be useful to compare retirement income approaches. And how is it that Jill's $550,000 can do the work of $1 million? It is because Jill is tapping into one of the unique strengths of insurance companies. Insurance companies can pull risk across tens of thousands of people, with insurance companies we can do more together than we can alone. Bill, on the other hand, must face the risks of retirement all by himself. If there is a financial mishap he only has himself to manage the impact of that setback, so consider your options, see if a fixed index annuity might be right for you. Carolina Benefits Group can be reached at cbgtoday.com.